Hey, what's going on, y'all? RJ here with CV Tech, and today I'll be comparing the Huawei Elite against the Alcatel Pulse Mix. Both of these here are on Cricut Wireless. So let's go ahead and get in with this comparison. Now we'll turn these both around, and of course, first of all, we'll go into CPU Z. And right here on the Huawei L8, we have a 1.4 gigahertz Snapdragon 435, an octa-core processor with an Adreno 505 GPU. This phone also has two gigabytes of RAM and 16 gigabytes of ROM with a 5.5 inch 720p display. Now over here on the Pulse Mix, you know, it shows here has a 1.5 gigahertz MediaTek MT6755 octa-core processor. Everywhere else I've read shows a quad-core processor. I've been to multiple sites and it says that it has a, indeed has an octa-core, uh, but it's an MT6738. So I've seen different things here with this device. It does say a Mali T860 GPU. So honestly, I have no idea exactly what processor is in the Alcatel Pulse Mix, but it does have a 5.2 inch display. Uh, 720 by 1280 with two, gigab two gigabytes of RAM and 16 gigabytes of ROM. So let's go ahead and back out of here. We will go into Geekbench 4 and look at the scores that I did run uh, on here. So we'll look at the history and pull up this. So as you see there on the Huawei L8, we got 655 single core score, 2899 multi core score, and 653 single core score, and 1759 multi core score here on the Alcatel Pulse Mix. Both these phones do run Android 7.0 Nougat. Now we'll back out of here, go into N22 Benchmark, and we will see here that the Huawei runs 44,535, pretty good score there, and 35,301 here on the Alcatel Pulse Mix. So we'll go ahead and go back home here, we'll clear everything out, and we will get started in with this comparison starting now. So we'll just get, we'll just try that one more time, uh, starting now. It was the Huawei L8, U2. That was the L8. Calculator, the L8. Calendar, the L8. The clock, the L8. Right now, let's take it away. Let's go to Google Plus. That was the L8. Let's go into camera. That was also the Elite. Let's go into IMDB. That was the Pulse Mix. Let's go into Instagram. That was the Pulse Mix. Let's go into the Play Store. That was the Elite. Settings. Elate, Snapchat, the Elate by a long shot there, uh, Twitter, that was the wall, that was the Huawei Elate, let's go into Periscope, so looks like the Elate is taking it here on these opening up app tests, let's go into Temple Run 2. So it looks like, let's see what's going to get it here. I do believe the Huawei Elite is going to take it here since it's already almost loaded. Yep, it looks like that the Huawei Elite took that test and we're still waiting there on the Pulse Mix. So there you go. Uh, let's go ahead and go into Subway Surfer. Now, in my personal opinion, the the, uh, the Alcatel Pulse Mix has a bit warmer screen and it's a bit sharper, maybe because it's a 5.2 inch display instead of a 5.5. Both of them look really good. It's just, in my opinion, I believe that the um, Alcatel looks a bit better. 
So that was, of course, the Elate Lyric once again. And we'll go into Sonic Dash here and just see what happens on this test as well. Now, it looks like that, of course, you know, the Huawei is going to take it here in this opening of this app as well. So I want to play this game a little bit just to show you how the gameplay does look a little bit here, you know, on both of these devices. So way ahead there on the Huawei L8. Let's just go ahead and play for a second. Now on these light games here, I don't really think that you're going to have much of an issue. Now I have seen a few more drop frames on the Alcatel Pulse Mix. Um, so it, it, it is what it is. Um, both phones are pretty nice though. Uh, of course the Huawei L8 is a faster device. Let's go back home here. Let's go into recent apps and we'll just open a few apps here and see what happens. The Elate. That was the Elate once again. Calculator, Elate. So you get the point here that the Elate is pretty much a faster device. I mean, it's not like blazing like a whole lot blazing much faster, uh, if you want to call it that, compared. But it is faster in opening up apps, playing up games. The Huawei Elate just seems to take it on everything that it does pretty much so there you go pretty close there on google plus uh look into imdb here and see if the huawei can take this one as take, take this one take take can take this one and the uh pulse mix took that one and so we'll just kind of go back in here to youtube if i can find it it's somewhere i know it is <laughs> YouTube so that was the Elate so as you can see there um, the Huawei Elate pretty much took it in you know, all these tests um, so what do you think I mean ready to go here had to reload here on the Alcatel so that was just my little comparison here between these two devices um, now What's the price? Now, I bought both of these here at Target, and the Huawei Elate is $65 right now at Target. That's what I paid for it. The Alcatel Pulse Mix is currently $79.99 at Target, and it does come, of course, with a phone, USB Type-C, and it does come with the sound snapback included with it. So $79 for the phone, plus the included um, sound sound snapback so $65 here $80 here it's really your preference uh, the faster phone the more reliable phone in my personal opinion is the Huawei L8 it's just a faster smoother phone but let me know in the comment section below what y'all think uh, if this was helpful and informative in any way, hit that like button. Any questions or comments you may have, leave it down below in the comment section and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. Y'all have a good one and we'll see y'all in the next video.